Hi, in this video, we will see how to make a new static library using code blocks. Press on create new project and choose static library, then go. Choose some name, I will choose first SL with this project, then finish. Let's add some code. We will make four functions, add, subtract, and multiplication and division, just to test the static library using these functions. And please note that we've just made a different names, but the content is the same. So all the functions now are an uh, add functions. After we build the project and ensure that there's no errors here, we will make a new concept project to test our static library. Choose a C project to avoid problems uh, due to name mangling. Now let's put the prototypes instead of make a new header file. Let's put them here and we have called the add function but we have still not linking yet so the build will give us error that there's no reference to the add function it's undefined reference now we will link the project to the static library just choose the path and the library to link here is it. Now we will press OK just to ensure. Let's press OK again. And now the library have been linked. Build the project and there's no errors. Now we can run the application here. You see here the number 2 which returned as 1 plus 1. Let's choose the multiplication function but remember it is an add function because of the content is the same uh, what I want to show you now is that if we change the code that will not affect the library until we rebuild the static library project so we have changed the code and let's try to run the project here again still the number 7 because we've not built not rebuild the static library project now we will rebuild the project and uh, so the library will change here is it after changing if we build the project again and run it you'll see the number 12 which is 3 times 4 let's try the division over zero which give us minus one okay that's everything thanks for watching